Think to yourself, well, uh, Minecraft's cool and all, but it's so easy and it gets boring after a while. I wish it was as challenging as Dark Souls 2. You know, you're not a sadomasochist? Eh, it doesn't matter. Introducing your own craft. If you're looking for the toughest, least forgiving Minecraft experience out there, you found it. You start off in this beautifully crafted world, minus the fucked up trees, and as you break your first tree, which can take up to five minutes, it yields. No wood. And then you get mauled to death. You try again. And after looting an abandoned structure and getting yourself the, the greatest, greatest weapon in game, you go cave exploring and stumble across some iron. Oh, sweet, some iron. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna nab that. Oh. You, you need level 4 mining to, to mine that. And then you get mauled to death after grinding your ass off, killing dozens of mobs and defenseless creatures to harvest enough skill power to mine iron. You succeed. Or should I say, FAIL! <laughs> Mining iron spawns mobs that kill you! Zombies are out to kill you! Skeletons are out to kill you! Oh no 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 no! The weather is out to kill you! Spontaneous combustion is fun! <laughs> Cutting down trees kills you, but it's kinda funny. <laughs> Sleeping spawns the fucking Grim Reaper! <laughs> Killing peaceful mobs spawns the fucking Grim Reaper! And dragons! <laughs> dragons will kill- Bitch! You start to understand how everything in this world is set to kill you. And it may seem hopeless at first, but don't give up! You've got the tools to fight back! Who? Me? Armed with 23 rocks you've picked off the ground, your trusty stone axe, and some red you've shamelessly stole off a villager, you're ready to start your own Auralcraft adventure! Alright, I, I know what I sounded to be, uh, cringeworthy and all, but... Auralcraft adds a few hundred new items to the mix. Tools, potions, morphine, morphine? But also a truckload of new weapons. And by a truckload, I, I actually mean it. What the fuck is this? A saber? But my favorite addition has to be bubbles! They're hella useful artifacts that grant you cool perks. But status effects, immunity to knockback, or super speed! Or just make you fucking tiny for no reason. <laughs> You can also get such status effects at Burger King, where you can consume delicious pixelated food. This is or how you eat a combat. Big Mac, nigga. <laughs> Cut the fuck! This mod also adds a bunch of new enchantments. Bruh. You've got some classics like High Jump. You can also find advanced versions of vanilla enchantments, and yes, they are OBAF. Explosive arrows, useful for wrecking habits, or also, you know, blowing yes. up your pals. And then I. <laughs> <laughs> and Supreme Sharpness 5, which lets you delete the Ender Dragon in two hits. Oh my god, look how oh much. Oh my gosh! <laughs> what? You killed it in two swings with the sword! I did! RL Craft brings some cool new mobs to the roaster. Some that follow the game's art style. Oh dear, oh gorgeous. Snail! <laughs> There's a snail here! <laughs> These nuts! No! And what I like to call polygonal nightmares. <laughs> Out of your friends, which are you? <laughs> There's over a hundred new additions, most of which are capable and rideable. You've got, for instance, Geonax. That can spawn yes, anytime you mine coal no, or iron. Captain Crunch. <laughs> You've also got nymphs, gentle passive creatures. They're attracted by flowers and grant you regen when you get close to them. Hey, hey, what are you doing, dude? Stop, stop trying to harm them. They, they give you healing. You're harming the most peaceful creature in this goddamn mod. You stupid. You've also got rocks. They're a piece of shit birds with the annoying ability to pick entities. <laughs> If you tame one, you can ride hey, it and make it pick anything <laughs> up! Destroy friendships by picking up your friends and dropping them off unskillable right. heights! Or just, you know, drowning them! <laughs> You've also got the ocean! Starring biped fish, <laughs> sea serpents, <laughs> sirens, oh, tentacle tentai, ah, ah, and the fucking Loch Ness Monster! Twice! And drop its skeletons! <laughs> Our Allcraft is one hell of a trip, and usually, you can sense the bullshit coming towards you from really, really far away. Why? <laughs> Said bullshit ranges from terrible architecture, this <laughs> is so bad, to unavoidable annihilation. Why? For example, your health bar works quite differently. Instead of having 10 hearts and dying when they reach zero, your health is divided between your head, body, and limbs. Good evening, Twitter. This means that you could easily die to a mere skeleton if you're unlucky enough to take, like, two arrows to the face. Like, that's ever gonna happen. 
In case you haven't guessed it already, dragons will turn your life into hell. Not only are they sometimes unreachable by arrows, they can and will one-shot you. Despite your Pro 4, Unbreaking 3, Blast Protecting, Fire- I think the fuck not. Some of them might even follow you home, turning your chest to ash and slaughtering your entire farm. <coughs> Some mobs, including Banshee, oh, the Grim Reaper, oh, and Spectres, oh, and rats, shit. Oh, oh, shit. can face through walls, which sucks. Also, they inflict status effects on you, which make you jiggle uncontrollably. Mom? <laughs> which can cause you to slide into lava. Slide to the left. Fuck off! This rat! This rat! Additionally, all hostile mobs have a thin chance of spawning as either Infernal or Blight mobs. Infernals are normal mobs that spawn with random enhancements. You could get an invisible zombie that drags you closer, a creeper that shoots fireballs back at you, or you could meet rare bloodsucking trumpet skeleton of conflagration. Finally, a worthy challenge. However, they do drop some kick-ass loot, like these warming airpods, warming airpods, oh god, or even the symbol of communism. Symbol. Lighted mobs, on the other hand, are just normal mobs, except they're on steroids. That's an easy way to put it. What the fuck is that noise? <laughs> the weather is bullshit too, and in some biomes and during the wrong seasonal conditions, it is physically impossible to stop freezing to death. Yes, even with warming airbox. But this terrible world is not as cruel as it seems. Yo. Despite the initial shock, this mod pack has been a fun experience, and I've had heaps of fun playing. And as the really? saying goes, the more the merrier. <laughs> yeah. I play with some friends, and the result is history. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Kill it, kill it, kill it. Fuck you, bitch! Help. Ah! It's, it's, it's not. Oh. Ah! What? Why is it killing me? Ah! <laughs> Speed, speed, remember I told you- uh, What the fuck?! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just shield. We did it! Oh. No! Hello, merchant, could I purchase no, some get out of here. 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 Please. Can I- Can I get a- I can't even pick it up. Yeah, you can. Yeah. You should get a right click. Anyway, I'd like Bye. to- Bye! Oh. Why?! <laughs> Help me! Help! I'm being dragged! <laughs> Hey, speeds! Vibe check. Where the fuck did my wood go? I stuck him. <laughs> Imagine forcing your dog to become a cannibal. Look, I didn't force it. I <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, fuck! No! Oh, <laughs> I have some friends. We need chicken. We need oh, why? Oh, Oh, dude, I just. It dragged me in lava! <laughs> it's John Wick. It's John Wick. Oh my god! Hey, hold on, hold on, speed, speed, speed! You're supposed to share that thing! I didn't know you could share it. Penis. <laughs> it's just staring! Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, no! I am off one perk 30. <laughs> Snoop in my chest, but ask and I'll give you. I said, don't snoop in my chest. All right, stand completely still. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. Fun fact: a lot of these clips were actually recorded live on Twitch. You can check me out at Twitch.tv/yahimais. I'm trying to stream regularly, so consider following me there. I'd appreciate it. Please, I beg you. <laughs>